adding and subtracting decimals using models. Before we start our math lesson, I want to tell you an interesting pig fact. Pigs are generally clean animals. The exception is when we pigs wallow in the mud. You might want to know why do we do that. There are two reasons. One, if there's insects biting us, we get in the mud to give a shell around us so the insects can't bite us. And the second reason is because we don't, don't sweat. So to cool down in the summertime, we get the mud on us and that cools us down. Now to adding and subtracting decimals. Using the place value model, I want you to know that between one and tenths, there is a decimal point. Okay. Four and seven tenths, four, seven tenths, plus two, that's two ones, and, that's the decimal, eight tenths, and seven hundredths. How many hundredths does four and seven tenths have? None, symbolized by zero. Now we add. Zero and seven is seven. Seven and eight is fifteen. We regroup. Put a one here. One and four is five, and two is seven. Four and seven tenths plus two and eighty-seven hundredths gives us seven and fifty-seven hundredths. Let's look how we subtract. Similarly, we make a table. This is kind of a model. And we think the ones, the tenths, and the hundredths. Five ones. First we put down our decimal. Five ones, zero tenths, seven hundredths. Minus two and one tenth, two ones, and one tenth, how many hundredths do we have? None, so we put zero, and we subtract. Seven take away zero, seven. We can't take one from zero, so we regroup, make this forty plus ten, 10 minus 1 is 9, and 4 minus 2 is 2. 5 and 7 hundredths minus 2 and 1 tenth equals 2 and 97 hundredths.